Bertolt Imhoff was born in Mannheim, Germany in 1868. He grew up in the peaceful woodlands along the Rhine. As a boy, Bertolt showed great promise as an artist and studied hard to perfect his technique. In 1900, Bertolt and his family boarded a steamship bound for North America. Bertolt's classical Renaissance style thrilled the Americans. In 10 short years, he painted more than 100 buildings across Pennsylvania and New Jersey. Bertolt was now 45, comfortable enough to slow down. But he couldn't. Something was pulling him out of the city, urging him to begin again. There were many uh, advertisements placed by the superintendent of immigration in uh, Ottawa, uh, painting Saskatchewan and the Northwest in the most beautiful colors. The frontier grabbed hold of Bertolt's imagination. It was a hard-fisted place. Immigrants from Eastern Europe broke their backs to clear the land and built homes out of sod. Bertolt, the artist, homesteaded differently. He hired men to build an astonishing 10-room wooden house on his farm, three miles south of St. Walberg in northwest Saskatchewan. For 25 years, Bertolt Imhoff painted Saskatchewan's churches, often for free. He opened his art studio to the curious eyes of neighbors and children hungry for culture. He grew poor like the people around him by sharing his wealth of talent. A German immigrant who yearned for open land, he painted a province from the palette of God. Observe the laws of Canada. Observe the laws of Canada. It fulfilled my duties as a Canadian citizen. 